Alright guys, here I am out in my flying field for some morning FPV before work. My plane, here's my little FPV setup. Um, I've made a few changes. Uh, I'm, I'm still flying my Mikey's RC YC14, but I took the tail, horizontal tail, it used to be up here and I moved it down here. I just like these flight characteristics better. I'm flying with my homemade circularly polarized FPV antennas. This is the clover leaf on the uh, transmitter. Then over here on my receiver, I've got the skew planar wheel. Um, so right now I'm getting ready to do a test flight, and I definitely recommend this for every time you fly FPV. I do it absolutely every single time. Uh, I set everything up, and I do one test flight. Just line of sight, I go out as far as I can, and then as high up as I can while still visualizing the plane and come back. The whole time just checking my video signal. So I'm gonna do it right now. All right, just finished my uh, test flight and everything looked great. Uh, video was perfect, I got out. I went out about 1,200 feet. Uh, max altitude of 334 feet. Max 43 amps, burned 470 milliamps, 52 miles an hour. So now I'm ready to fly FPV. All right, here we go. Immediately with this flight, I think you guys can see the quality of the video coming through. Not only is this a high quality camera here, but these antennas are just really awesome. Uh, biggest thanks to IB Crazy for inventing these and to RC Explorer for giving me the guide necessary to build these. Here I'm going down the path, like about 40 miles an hour, just cruising right here. And the video quality, I am 1500 feet from home, not too far off the ground, just a hundred and some feet. The video quality is great. Here I'm about 500 feet up in the air, it's turning around. This is Lake Michigan down below me. And there's a lot of moisture in the air today. Here I am at a thousand feet. You can see the video starts getting a little crappy. There's a lot of moisture that's starting to dip into the clouds there. Here I come out going into a sort of a nose dive on purpose. Then I started getting pretty fast and I decided to pull out of it. And this field I fly at, it's really like falling around these paths. It's really easy flying with this cargo plane. It's a lot of fun. Those trees got in the way. Really fun just to follow these around this field here. I don't like going out over the water too much because I have lost planes in the lake before. But this uh this wall right here, it's really fun to fly along. Here I am going into a bit of a nosedive on purpose once again, just to bring it down. This plane isn't terribly fast, I'm only hitting about 40 miles an hour. It's still a lot of fun though, and landing. Alright guys, that was a lot of fun. This is another successful FPV flying trip. I didn't want to go too much past like the 2900 feet down there because that's the end of the island and also I'm still running this Spectrum uh, 2.4 gigahertz RC control system so I didn't want to do that yet but these uh, circularly polarized antennas have been working great. Uh, as you can see it's a little bit of a foggy day out and there is some there's some low clouds so I think that did affect my uh, video range and quality a little bit but overall it was awesome there are no dropouts um, these antennas are awesome I've been really really happy with them. Alright thanks for watching.